What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. As you can see behind me, there is a palm tree over there and there's no palm trees where we live. I'm actually in SoCal for the weekend. I'm not up here for anything car related. I'm not doing any car content or anything like that. I'm just up here with some family for a couple of days. I don't really plan on vlogging this trip, but if there's something cool that I can vlog, I'll definitely pull the camera out. As you guys know, whether it's car content or not, I always love vlogging. After saying that, you guys are probably wondering why I'm vlogging right now if I'm not planning on vlogging this trip. And that's because I actually messed up big time, guys. I had a video going out for you guys today, which is Friday. Unfortunately, I deleted all the clips that I had recorded the other day. I was recording something a little bit different and I forgot to import everything from the camera to the computer. And usually when I'm recording something new, I delete the previous clips that I had recorded on the camera. So I deleted them not knowing that I had not imported them, if that makes any sense. Long story short guys, I deleted the video that was supposed to be going out to you guys on Friday and now I don't have a video for this week. So I wanted to vlog for you guys and explain to you what happened in that video. So if you guys remember in the last video, I told you guys that we were gonna take the STI to a shop to get the rear flares removed or the rest of them that were molded on. And we were also going to get the rear quarter panels welded together because they were never welded together when I installed the flares. So in the video that I recorded, we took the car down to Roger. Roger's the one that's gonna be doing this for me. He's gonna be removing the rear flares that are molded and he's also gonna be welding those rear quarter panels. So what he's gonna do with that is he's going to, I don't know if you guys have seen it, but they do it a lot where they cut that first piece of metal a little bit shorter and then they put those slits in it, kind of what we did with Chino's car. And then he's gonna bend those up and then weld it and pretty much seal it up completely so that I don't have any issues with water or anything like that getting in there to prevent any rust. I believe he's also gonna primer everything, that way it's ready to go into paint. All that's gonna get done, it's gonna get welded, those rear flares are gonna be coming off, and I also dropped off the rear over fender on the door piece and the rear over fender on the rear quarter panel piece. He needed that just in case, if he needed to cut a little bit more or shave down anywhere, that way the kit fits on there perfectly. Sorry guys, I had to come over to the car, it got dark pretty quick out there. As I was saying, I am I'm leaving SoCal on Monday so hopefully the car will be ready on Tuesday so I can go pick it up once we're there we'll check out the car we'll show you guys exactly what Roger did and I'll have him go over everything that way you guys know exactly what he did another cool thing that I filmed when we were there is all of the cars that he has and the cool things that he's doing to his own cars so when we go back we'll definitely check all of that out he has a GC wagon that he just picked up and he like completely stanced out, it was all crazy. He had STI seats, he had all these cool things on that car. And then he also showed us his Lexus that was actually at the High Aces Rally Show that was still there at his shop, he actually sold that. But like I said, once we go back and pick up the STI, we'll show you guys all of that. Roger was such a cool dude, shout out to him for doing this for me. He does all sorts of things, he welds, he makes his own wide body kits. He said he paints, but he's not really comfortable with it too yet. So huge thank you to Luis, I filmed with Luis that day and he actually took me to drop my car off and take me back home. So thank you Luis, I appreciate that. But that's gonna do it for today's video guys. I know it was super short, but I didn't wanna leave you hanging this week. Stay tuned for Tuesday, we're gonna go pick the Suvi up and hopefully everything turns out well. He's also gonna be texting me updates and pictures of the car while he's working on it. So um, if it gets here in time, by the time I edit this video, I'll post some up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace out.